Welcome back to Bay Area Focus. Blue Bear School of Music has been a home for aspiring musicians, 30,000 of them since it opened up in 1971. And here to discuss is Development Director Renee Richardson and musician Shannon Kaler. Thanks for coming on the show. Oh, thanks for thanks. having us. Yeah. All right, so music has always been a part of your lives, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. yeah. Used to be on a morning show or a radio show. I was on a radio morning show here okay. in the Bay Area for years. I helped develop the whole local scene vibe at that radio station. I'm just a lover of music, but he's one of my favorite musicians. You yeah. are the Stone a musician. Foxes. Yeah, yeah, our band, the Stone Foxes, and she's been having us on for years. And so. you're a drummer and... Yeah, I sing and drum and play the tin sandwich. He... That's the harmonica. <laughs> yeah. He is so talented, it's not even funny. When they uh. play, the, everybody in the band will take turns, pick up different instruments, get the audience totally into it. Like, it, they're a sight to be seen. Yeah, it sounds like it. Okay, so tell me about, tell me about the school. The Blue Bear School of Music. So Blue Bear School of Music is a nonprofit music school located in San Francisco. We're over at Fort Mason, and we've been around since 1971. We don't say enough that we are the original school of rock. Four musicians came together in the 70s, and they said, hey, we want to make music, but we need to make a living. Let's start a school. And they started Blue Bear School of Music, and it's been carrying on ever since. Where did Blue Bear come from? Oh, <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> I had to reread this story about 400 times to fully understand it. But Wolfgang and Strauss was the name of the band okay. that started the school. They lived up by the Bear River. So this is a nod to Johann Strauss's Blue Danube River. And it evolved into Wolfgang and Strauss, bear, beautiful bear music, whatever. And now it is Blue Bear School of Music. <laughs> okay, well, we like, I'm glad they changed it to Blue Bear School of Music. <laughs> Me too. It's so more easy. Simple. Yeah. Yeah. And, yes. and not to mention, Wolfgang was a dog. So, okay. <laughs> put that into the mix. Very good. So, it, it works. It's okay. Um, so, let's talk about the music and, and what this provides. How easy is it for someone to pick up an instrument and learn to play? I don't know. That's that's kind of what you do if you don't have anything else to do, and I think it's awesome. You know, uh, my brother and I grew up in the middle of nowhere, so that's kind of all we had to do. But I hear Blue Bear kids. They they play in the uh, space next to us at our rehearsal space downtown, uh -huh. and they're the best thing that that comes out of that rehearsal space. Like if you hear something sound good, it's usually them. It's usually the kids, and they're awesome in it. It, uh, you need those teachers, yeah. and you need those people to get you started, and, um, and with schools not providing that all the time now, right. um, it's super huge to be able to have a group like this that, that gets that started for you. Yeah, a lot of music programs have been cut out oh, yeah. from schools. Yeah. And, so yeah. and, and who knows what's going to happen in the future. There may be more cut, but our job is to make sure people can play the music they love. And as a music lover, I would like them to play well. So that's why we support music education. That's important. My mom always said, stop playing the high notes. Stay the, play the low notes, Shannon. Stay low. Well, you were a drummer, so what, did oh, you drive your mom nuts? I don't know. She's an angel to the fifth degree. I don't know. Love you, Mom. Yeah, that's amazing when moms do that. But, but yeah, you need someone to start you yeah. so that you can go the classical route or the rock and roll route, yeah. but at least get that basic education, you know. Yeah, and what are the ages involved in this? At Blue Bear in particular, we teach everybody. We have a Little Bears program for kids under five just to get them started mm -hmm. with music and the idea of playing music together. And then, really, it's, you know, the preteens, the teens, they are the major portion of our programming because we can do after-school programs, we do in-school programs, and then there's adults. I mean, we could teach anybody. I, I took a singing class. I didn't do so well. How are you doing? Uh, I'm going to move to piano. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it was good. I bet you'll be like crawling on the piano right. like Michelle Pfeiffer. Right. Yeah, That's I'll you. That. Yeah. That's probably you. Fabulous Baker boy. Right. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, I remember that. Okay. I mean, does it matter? Do you have to start at a young age or you can, can you be this good musician who starts out later in life? I don't even know if it really matters if you're that good. Yeah. I mean, I think being able to play just opens you up to communication with other people. Yeah. And, and you can get good later on. Like, uh, the other main guy, uh, vocalist in our band, Vince DeWald, he started playing guitar when he was 16, and that's relatively late. Yeah. And, um, but, yeah, he's dynamite. 
And not to mention, there's always punk rock. Mm -hmm. You don't really have to know how to play for <laughs> <Could> be <laughs> the Ramones, yeah. <laughs> and what about uh, this fundraiser coming up? So on Saturday, April 1st, we are going to be having our annual fundraiser for Blue Bear School of Music. And the party is going to be a fantastic party. There's a VIP level. That is a really good thing to do because uh, you'll get cocktails, get a little VIP fun with the Sam Chase and some other things. But the show is all about the Stone Foxes and Combrio. And it's a $30 ticket. All the money we raise, thanks to the bands, all the money we raise is going to go right back to the school and continue our outreach programs and continue our programming in San Francisco. That is awesome. Yeah. Is yeah. it is it good for you to just see the reaction from the kids and oh yeah and how they're affected by this? Yeah, I mean we've we've done stuff with with kids before and had kids choirs and things like that. And every time you do it, it's it's amazing. And what's what's really cool is watching the audience yeah. because for them to see kids be on stage and to kill it too yeah. like these kids aren't just okay you know like they're, <laughs> they're really good, good. they're yeah. really good yeah and so when they good. come up and you know we'll have a few guests i'm sure Combrio will too and they'll be awesome you yeah. know it's really cool all right sounds great thank you so much for coming on the yeah, show and telling you. us about this Thanks. and to find out how you can get involved just log on to bluebearmusic.org again that's bluebearmusic.org and up next an event that was inspired by the ciclovia in bogata Colombia. Stay tuned.